You're watching Adorama TV. Hey everybody, welcome to Adorama TV. I'm Mark Wallace. Well, a lot of photographers really want a little bit longer battery life for their cameras as well as the functionality of a pro level body, in other words, a vertical grip. And you can get both of those by just adding a uh, battery grip. Now, Flashpoint makes some uh, battery grips that are $80, and we're showing uh, two of them here, one for a Canon and one, one for the Nikon. Both of these are $80. Now, let me just walk you through the advantages of a battery grip and then show you some of the things that these come with. Now, on a battery grip, what you're looking for is a longer battery life, but more than that, what you want to be able to do is grab your camera and have the exact same functionality horizontally that you do vertically. So if you look at this, we have our shutter release, we have our uh, uh, controls right here, our manual focus button, our um, function button right there. You've got on the back here, um, your autofocus point selection, and etc. We have all these buttons, and they are exactly the same here as they are here. So when you're shooting, you can go quickly from horizontal to vertical, and it's going to fa uh, fall right into your hand, and it's going to be great. Now, one of the things that a great battery grip is always going to have is it's going to have this on or off switch. And the reason for that is if you leave that on all the time and you're shooting uh, vertical or horizontally like this, sometimes it's easy to bump that switch and you'll be taking pictures against your leg or something. You don't want that, so you can actually turn this off so these switches aren't functioning, or you'll be able to turn those back on and it'll be just great. So that's what uh, both of these Flashpoint battery groups have, the ability to quickly switch your camera from uh, horizontal to vertical. But the other thing that you can do with this is you can really extend the battery life of your camera um, by actually, instead of having just one battery, well, you can actually put two batteries inside of your battery grip, and so you've got double the battery life. Now, the other thing, just as a backup, if all else fails and these batteries run out, uh, all these battery grips come with a, a AA battery um, tray like this, and so that will pop right in there, and so that if these batteries run out and you just have to have batteries, you can use a AA battery rack like that, and then you can just throw this in there and um, you'll be off and running in no time, so that just pops right in there like that. And so you have that, and this locks in. Um, and let me show you on the Nikon how you can put this together. It's really, really simple. Um, so let me show you. So the battery grip itself looks sort of like this. It's the grip, and then there's this little tower here with all these connectors on it, and that's where all the controls uh, plug into your camera, and this takes the place of where the battery would normally go. And then there's this thread that mounts to the tripod thread, and that's how it locks onto your camera. And there's still a tripod thread on the bottom so that you can still mount your camera to a tripod if you need to. So to do this, all you have to do is take your camera, and this is a D90, and the uh, battery compartment, you open that up and you'll take your battery out of your camera. And all of these on uh, your battery's uh, little lid here, they actually just sort of snap right off, just like that. It's not going to break it. It just allows you to pop that right off. See your instruction manual to make sure you know how to do that. On the D90, you just sort of pull it off and it unclips. Once you have that, then you take your battery grip and it just slides right into that battery compartment. And then there's this big dial right here, and that allows you to screw that uh, thread right into the bottom of your camera. And now these are uh, actually screwed together, so there's a really, really tight bond there. And then again, you have your control right here, control right here, and when you flip, again, you have it right there, the same exact thing. You can lock this. So you can turn these uh, on and off. And this is actually recessed, which is really nice. It's going to make sure that you don't accidentally fire anything. And then you've got your controls, just like you do on the horizontal grip, right there on the back. Now, on this, uh, let me show you one more time. What you have here is you have your AA batteries that you can throw right in there um, for some extended battery life. So you can either throw that in there or you can put in a battery. Now, the cool thing is if you don't have two batteries, this will work on just a single battery as long as you uh, put it in there right. There it goes, just like that. So you don't have to have two batteries right off the bat. You can run on one battery. You're going to get the exact same battery life as normal with the added benefit of having the control surfaces that allow you to go from horizontal to vertical. And so you can add batteries uh, as time allows and as your budget allows. And so that's what a battery grip is going to allow you to do. You have those uh, control surfaces plus uh, sort of a safety net of battery power if you need it. 
and then you also have um, extended battery life. And so both of these battery grips are $80, and uh, we're just showing the one that's for the uh, Canon 7D and the Nikon D90, but the uh, Flashpoint makes battery grips for other cameras as well. So Canon Rebels, the 50D, the Canon 5D Mark II, the, the Nikon D700, and the D300, just to name a few. There are several others, and you can check out Adorama.com to see exactly which cameras you can buy these Flashpoint battery grips for, because there are a lot um, available. Well, that's all we have time for today. Remember, if you have a question about photography gear, you can send that to me at askmark at Adorama.com, and we'll try to answer your question right here on Adorama TV. Well, thanks for joining me. I'll see you again next week. This episode is brought to you by Adorama TV. Visit the Adorama Learning Center where you'll find photography tips and techniques, links to the gear used in this episode, and related videos. For all the latest photography, video, and computer gear, visit Adorama.com. And the next time you're in New York City, visit our store located on 18th Street between 5th and 6th Avenue.